Аран само да на, накрая били направил пак отново. Е, Рокко! Е, Рокко! Е, Рокко! I'm making a, an exhibition in uh, Plovdiv, Bulgaria. It's the second biggest city in Bulgaria. You are free to talk, sir. Right now. Mm -hmm. uh, I have to introduce myself. I guess. I and uh, I am doing an exhibition that is supported by the American Embassy there. Um, it opens on September 11th and it's called Americana Esoterica and it's, uh, and it's looking at esoteric phenomena in cultural practice in contemporary art. Uh, hi, my name is Aaron Moulton and I'm the curator of the exhibition Americana Esoterica. I'm looking particularly at Californian artists, uh, artists from California or based here, working here, uh, whose practices touch on ritual, magic, alchemy, fringe science, uh, and things like that. Uh, it's kind of a, uh, an artificial uh, movement of sorts to try to look at uh, esoteric practices within visual culture. The exhibition will be structured like a conspiracy theory uh, from the voice of a kind of a paranoid prophet and, uh, and, and maybe acting like a bit like a hoax. And maybe you're maybe not uh, a hoax. I don't want to talk about that on camera. So uh, there's a lot of kind of uh, veils of uh, information there in terms of how we see a cultural practice, uh, export a cultural practice, uh, and then kind of mediate that cultural practice from afar, and it's all very self-conscious. We don't even talk about content anymore, it's all about packaging. Uh, it's classic in the 20th century to, to do this cultural export thing, you know, it's like a real colonial gesture uh, to be like, you know, the best art of America, and, uh, or whatever, you know, so I find that hilarious. American Esoterica is, uh, is really looking I think most simply at the avant-garde. What does the avant-garde mean today for, for visual culture and for contemporary art? Esoterica is, is, a, uh, is really the, the kind of outer limits of, of, uh, of, cultural, uh, of cultural language. It's, it's maybe the last kind of undiscovered or uh, unknown kind of terrain that we have in our uh, current uh, informational landscape, which is ultimately very flat. Uh, I mean, it's fucking uh, an, an insane reality that we live in now. Uh, uh, it's now. Paintings, Drugies. installations. It's going to be magic, superstition, mm -hmm. um, religious revelations, and uh, and really the most avant-garde possibility you can imagine. Everything we don't understand, and uh, and we do believe in things like energy and magic and and God and all of that. So you know you know we have this in, this fantastic uh, ability to be irrational. I'm going to send the press release out here in the next day or two, and I'm hoping people are like, are you okay? It's going to be a lot of um, uh, site-specific work that we're going to make um, uh, in Bulgaria. Um, uh, artists in the show are Sterling Ruby, Mike Boucher, Jason Metcalf, Max Hooper Schneider, and Jennifer West. And they all have very different practices uh, from, you know, dealing with uh, the language of the folkloric, superstitions, literal mad science, and uh, alchemical capitalism what single-handedly created religion and art. You know? Of doing this now, today, what does this mean to do a show of American art uh, in a place that no one's going to ever see it? You know, I'm going to have such a tight control over the mediation of it that uh, it's going to be what I want it to be. Do you have a crystal ball? Uh, no, but I can, I can sing a prayer for you. Should I do it? Listen to me. Europa. Europa. I've, I've said all that shit in the press release.